Around the age of seven, now it was diagnosed with a disease called vascular malformation, where there's just a large entanglement of veins. It was really painful. A few years after, I was in a wheelchair pretty much always. Andrew lost his smile at the age of seven. His life was very serious. He wasn't walking at all. Barely able to hobble to the bathroom, there were nights that he would crawl into our room on his hands and knees in pain. We couldn't watch him live like this anymore. At that point, the doctors agreed that amputation was a viable option. We knew this had to be his decision. And can you imagine making this decision at 13 years old? October 2013, I decided that I wanted to amputate my leg. Amputation came, everything went great. All the excitement and all the anticipation of him walking, it suddenly and drastically changed again. He couldn't get a good fit. This is my bucket that I had as my first socket. It's just, it's a bucket. It's, there's like no adjustability. It was really hard to get a com comfy fit. They just gave me no options. I just had to get the bucket. When we got introduced to the limb socket is when I realized how uncomfortable his original socket was. He has done a complete 180. I mean, the things he's been able to do, he is, he gets up every morning excited to put his leg on. He loves his socket and he's able to be a kid. He can go anywhere, he can do anything. The imminent socket just has allowed me to want to wear my leg and walk around. One of my favorite features about the infinite socket is just the adjustability with the ratchet that like anytime I can just loosen or tighten it. My body's like constantly changing so my socket should be able to do that as well. My name is Mary Seelhoff. I'm the proud mom of an amputee and I love the limb socket. My name is Andrew Seelhoff. I'm a kid and I love my infinite socket. My honey, I love this. Ha, ha, ha.